Hello and welcome. Today, I wanted to talk, take a little bit of time and talk to you about the stress, the anxiety, and what do you actually want to do with your life. Are you one of those who parents said you're to be nothing, we need you to be a dentist, you're needing to be a dentist or a doctor or a, a teacher or something, and everybody as you grew up was telling you you needed to be something. We're, and you decided, you know what, that's right, everybody wants me to be this thing, I'm going to be this thing, and you blindlessly, blind, blindless, blindedly heeded their direction. You walked that path that they chose for you. They knew that that was the best thing for you. If you're a doctor, you've got it made. If you're a dentist, you've got it made. If you are uh, an accountant, you've got it made. If you're an insurance agent, you know what? You've got it made. All these thoughts of people who have got it made, but they never once stopped to ask you, what do you actually want? Maybe you like to sit down and you like to write. Maybe you're a writer or maybe you like to paint. Uh, or you just, you've got something, you've got a passion inside of you. Uh, you had an uncle who told you that you, uh, when you told him you were going to be a, uh, a screenwriter uh, in Hollywood, he laughed at you and said, dude, you'll never make it. And so immediately you went, that thought, that dream, you were like, oh, okay, well, he knows better. He knows more. He's older. He's, he's, I'm just a little scrawny 17-year-old kid who's never left their house more than a night. How am I supposed to know while my uncle apparently does? So you take that dream of being the screenwriter and being an award-winning screenwriter and you took it and you mashed it down and you tucked it away. It's like, you know what, that was really a stupid idea. I don't want to be that. But yet, there's something that always nags on you. You're, you're, you're an accountant, you go in every day, you sit there and look at people's uh, tax information and, and the incoming and you balance out the incomes and the outgoings and the and the accounts receivable versus the accounts receiving. You do all the stuff that accountant actually does, which I personally have no clue. <laughs> so and you have this sinking sensation, this feeling way down inside of you that tells you this is not what I want to do. Maybe on Saturday you feel wonderful. You go out and you do stuff. You go hiking out in the woods and all that. And you enjoy nature. But come Sunday, all of a sudden you get this... Uh, stomach hurts. I'm not feeling right. Um, or even worse, you know, you get a bout of depression. You realize that somewhere down the way you're, it's time, you start... Uh, Maybe you started drinking a bit, and as the time has gone on, a, a drink at night comes into two drinks, comes into five drinks, comes before you're down in a six-pack, maybe even a 12-pack. Even a and you're realizing you've, uh, you may have been like me and reached the age of 40, and you're like going, holy smokes, I am nowhere where I thought I was going to be at this time in my life. What am I supposed to do with myself? Well... There is hope, and that's where my camping coach comes into play. Uh, it's not a Insta-fix. I'm not trying to sell an Insta-fix. This isn't something that you're going to go, and you're going to come back, and you're going to be a brand new man, and you're going to be buff and fit, and your wife is going to love you deeply, and everything's going to be wonderful, and you're going to sing Kumbaya as y'all skip down the middle of Main Street, and you're elected mayor. No, that's not going to happen. Not here. Somebody else may have a, have a program that can get you there within three days. Not here. Here, this, one, this event that I'm putting together, this uh, Relaxed Males Camp of Coaches, happening May 7th to May 10th. This is a four-day event. We arrive on the 7th, get camp set up, or I should already have camp set up by, by the time you arrive, and... We're going to spend those four days, May 7th to you leave on the 10th, being coached. I'm seeing about bringing a couple other coaches in who would like to help out. But then through the, through the day, you're able to relax. You've got, there's, there's things to... You can go out and you can go for a hike. You can, uh, there's a pond that's just 
not even a hop, skip, and a jump from us that is, you can, if you have a, you know, if you have a legal uh, a fishing license, you can go and you can go fish in the, in the pond. There are things, uh, the things that you'll be able to, uh, there are things that you'll be able to do through, throughout the day, but during that time, I'm going to, I'll be going through and I'll be sitting down and I'll be talking with people. It may be a 15 minute talk. It may be a three hour talk and it will be until we find out what everybody wants to do, what everybody needs and how they can help each other. Uh, and then in, in the evening, well, I'll be cooking supper for you. And as the, uh, as, uh, supper is consumed and is tied up and, and we, we get rid of, uh, get rid of all the delicious, uh, hamburgers or salmon or steaks that we'll end up having there in those, there in those three nights. One of those things that we're going to do is we're going to have a mastermind group. We're going to have a ma meeting and at night we're going to sit around the campfire and we're going to come up with solutions. We're going to figure out how do you get from place A to place B so that you can pole vault over to place C. There's a lot of mindset issues and mindset changes that are going to happen with that and it's gives you a plan and that's what I want to be able to do. I want to help you get a plan. I want to help you have an idea of what of a, an actual roadmap of going from place A to place B because nobody's lives are the same. This is a men only event. I'm not going to be asking for you to bring your wives and your kids along. This is for you. Now you may have some problems. You may even have some objections of going, well, I, I can't. My wife needs me here all the time. Well, no, she doesn't but you need to come up with a, with the reason as to why you need to be here this is to help you this is to help you become the, a a better man to become a stronger man become a more compassionate man so that you can be there for your spouse be there for your kids be the dad that you've been wanting to be instead of climbing into a truck and being gone for 6 months coming back and seeing that you're watching your children grow from the from the cab of a truck is one of the most frustrating and heart-wrenching things a dad can see. But we do what we're supposed to do, aren't we? So if you want to become a better guy, if you want to grow and develop and, and realize what your dream is, what your true calling is, then come on over here to uh, Croton Creek on May 7th. And we'll see what we can find for you and see if, help you take that dream and needle it out of, of your, uh, out of your subconscious and unfold it again and l breathe some new life into that passion. You can do that. I know you can do that. And the other men that are going to be here in this group are also going to help you do that. So come with me. I know this is a bit long for a sales pitch, but... I want you to come with me to Croton Creek. Uh, there's a link down in the description that will take you over to the to the the Camp and Coach live event. And there are a couple of options there. One is where you be part of the community. You'll be a group, and as people join, there'll be there's a Facebook group and and other uh, other little perks that are going to happen in that uh, in that group. So that everybody can start to get to know each other. We're going to have some, uh, some webinars and things like that. If you want to really step it up, then there's another package where I give you some extra coaching on the side. And there's four uh, coaching sessions there besides for the initial because I always, the initial coaching session is always uh, free of charge. I, that's me getting to know you and you getting to know me. So come with me, join me on the uh, Relaxed Mail Camp and Coach. Find that calling that is within you that's dying to get out, just aching to get out. And I know that you are tired of that soul-sucking job that you're going to. And there's more to your world than what anybody else has ever realized. So come along. So click that link 
and join me on May 7th as we come out here to the to this area. It should be a lot greener. <laughs> and we will see you then. Thank you.